David. I'm an empath, intuitive. I help to open people up, help you remove your blockages, feel a lot better, be able to recognize what's been holding you back and actually do something about it now so that you can move forward. And so I'm sitting here thinking today, when you're feeling a certain thing, when you want something to happen, a lot of times we really hyper focus on the detail of. So, uh, you know, it's very specific, a, a specific individual. You know, we want love, want to feel love, find our soulmate, find our partner, what have you, right? And, and then we're specifically saying we want, you know, that person, right? Or uh, a certain type of job, but it has to be that job, right? Um, what if, and I want to suggest something to you, what if, instead of viewing it that way, what if you put yourself in the feeling of what you're actually looking for feels like, like if you received it, if you already had it, how would that make you feel? And be in that space for a minute, right? And then I want you to remove the story, remove the details, remove uh, this particular person, this particular job. I want you to get in the feeling of without calling that job that person. And why am I asking you to do that? Because what you're wanting is a true, genuine, real result. You want, you want something that is that is true to who you are now and who you plan to be later, who, and things that you don't even know who you plan to be later. But it's a genuine thing, it's organic, it's natural. And, and, and if you put the feeling there, then the universe will deliver that, fe that, that result back to you. But once you start saying specifically, hey, I want that person, that job, that you know, XYZ car, instead of, instead of what those things are gonna make you feel like, um, then you start to try to be the architect and the engineer instead of letting spirit be the architect and the universe deliver the how and you just reap the benefits. Because if you do what you're supposed to do, if you're coming from the right intent place, then you'll be provided for and it will make sense for you. Um, and you'll feel like it's organic and natural and that, um, and you'll understand the wonder of it and the appreciation and the grace of it all. Um, you have enough to do to try to make something happen. Uh, why, not let's, why not let spirit show you where, the how, and you just, you just be really clear on what it is that you're wanting the result to be, how that feels. And everything else will be given to you. All the third dimensional specifics will be provided. Doesn't mean you're not gonna do some work. It doesn't mean that you know, everything's done for you. You have to put in some effort, yeah. But it's very different when you feel like you're guided and you're told what to do than when you're sitting with yourself and you're saying, what should I do? How should I do it? And then, and then you have to actually go do it. So what if you were shown how, shown what to do, and all you had to do was execute. Think about all your energy, 100% of your energy going to that instead of your energy being dispersed between trying to, you trying to game the universe and figure out how this is all really going to shake down. Uh, doesn't make a lot of sense. It's what we do. It's what we're taught to do naturally 
but doesn't make a lot of sense. And if you let go, what you'll really find is you're not really letting go. You're just letting go to what you can actually control and do and be. And that's a cool place. So until next time, be well. Now we go way, way back as far as way back goes. Still standing by.